Hi, Happy Hisses here. I want to show you my way of breeding Dubaias. I use two 30 quart containers which I put into each other. In the top I cut out part of the bottom and Lugan a grid too. And the little babies fall through the grid. In the top I put about 50 females, 10 males and some nymphs which I cannot see in here. Uh, you have to put a couple of nymphs in because it gives them the feel that this is a real colony, the females, and they release the babies much easier and faster and more, I believe. In the bottom I put a paper towel for the little guys to hide under and put food in one lid and a wet paper towel in the other, in another lid. And let's see what happened here. There are lots of babies. They all collect under. It's really, really easy when you need little ones to feed your pets with. Here is another one. And here is what did they all hide? Oh, here they are, all under the wet paper towel lid. Once a month I take all the babies and put them in their own little container to grow. And this is one of those containers. They are rather large now. And it is pretty much time to put them in a large container to grow. This does, it does not take them very long to grow this large. With the right temperature, the right food, it goes pretty fast. I sell Dubaias. Uh, check me out on happyhissers.com. And when I send out 100 Dubaias, I usually put in 10 females and 10 males and about 100 nymphs. I'm pretty good at overcounting, but the majority of the nymphs I sent out are this size. I have a couple of them in. This is actually the smallest size. I do not send out any itty bitty ones. So check me out on happyhisses.com. Thank you. Bye.